Uh, well, I think it all started on the mound. Mike, uh, you know, just came out and uh, just battled and competed. I don't think, you know, I mean, he's had uh, strep throat. Uh, it's 106 degrees. Uh, you know, we got several guys battling it, but I mean, it's just been. Uh, been sort of with just one weekend after another. We just keep having to battle adversity and we keep doing it. And I thought he sort of went out and won that on guts and, uh, you know, thought he pitched good and kept us in the game there. And, and really the one line, you know, was a, a little bleeder that uh, maybe we could call it. But, uh, he just did a great job of getting himself out of jams, making big pitches at big times, and then offensively uh, took us a while to get going. Andrew's home run was really big to answer the one run immediately and just get us back tied. Um, and then, you know, got to the fourth or fifth, and uh, actually Coach Anderson sort of called it. He's like, we're getting ready to break it open right here. And uh, Greer has great at bat, gets it to 3-1, gets a good pitch to drive, and it starts out with a triple, and then, you know, we go triple, double, triple, and uh, boom. I mean, it was quick. And, uh, you know, and, and we had a big change in the batting order today. Uh, I think that worked out great for us. And, uh, you know, we've done that a little bit earlier in the year, saying that's what we – that's what it should work, and uh, so we decided it was going to work today. Yeah. And Mike, you said last night the per you didn't feel like it was a pressure game for you. You were just going to go out there and throw, and the hitters were going to pick you up. Just um, that's how it worked out today. Just how did you feel out there today? Uh, I mean, absolutely. I mean, the guys uh, did a good job of picking me up. I mean, I didn't have my best stuff today, but I felt like I, uh, a battle. I needed a battle, and uh, just you don't want to go home. You know, especially being a senior, and this is like last conference tournament. Okay, we might rank, make a regional, but I mean, this is it. I mean, it's do or die, win or go home. And uh, <clears throat> I didn't have my best stuff and kind of struggled early, but then guys got those three runs <clears throat> and uh, really helped me out. I could, uh, relax and kind of get on cruise control there, and uh, I think it was just a big win for us. Uh, we kept saying, "Get to tomorrow, get to tomorrow," and we keep getting to tomorrow. We're gonna win this thing. Greer, just um, you got the big hit to start it off, just um, picking him up and get, getting that going. Just how important was that for you guys? Yeah, I mean, it was huge. Uh, you know, we you know, we struggled early, you know, we weren't having good at bats, and, you know, we just stayed with it, you know, after they had that first run in that second inning, you know, Lacombe's home run right there. I mean, it was it was huge for us, and, uh, I mean, it was, it was really big, and, then, you know, we just, you know, we kept battling, you know, we behind Mike the whole way. We knew, you know, we don't want to go home, we're going to battle the whole way. And, uh, we're a bunch of competitors, you know, they, you know, this is going to be, you know, if we're going to lose, we're done. So we don't want that, so we're going to battle the whole way. Yeah, obviously, uh, Kingsville had a lot of base runners early on, a lot of runners even in scoring position, and I thought maybe one of the key turning moments of the game, there was bases loaded, a comebacker, I think, uh, maybe you, you got a bit of it, Mike, yeah. and uh, they turned double play behind you, you guys get out of that inning yeah. clear. Was that, was that a big boost for you at that point? No, I mean, that was awesome, you know, bases loaded and getting double play, like I said, uh, last week, double play was huge for us, and again, it helped us out a lot uh, today with that ground ball to Coon, I mean, I thought I might have caught it, but... I'm glad I got a little bit of it and uh, not more because, you know, things like that happen where you, you stick your glove out there on reflex and might knock it down and then we have no play. But luckily I just got a little bit of it and couldn't make a play on it. He told me to put some uh, pretty nasty spin on it, but he still stuck with it and got the double play. That was huge. Hey, you guys have St. Mary's tomorrow, Coach. Just uh, two tradition um, South Central region teams. Just uh, what are you expecting out of tomorrow? Well, you know, one, I mean, Charlie Meagle, he's won over a thousand games. Uh, so he sort of knows how to win. Um, they, uh, you know, they won this tournament last year and went to the World Series, so I'm sure they want to defend their title. Um, nobody I have more respect for uh, in D2 baseball than, than them. Um, you know, they got 30 hits today. Uh, that's a little scary. Uh, and scored 24 runs. So, uh, and then they're going to pitch and play defense. So. It's going to be a battle, uh, but, uh, you know, we're going to try to show up and be ready to go. But uh, we're going to have to play very well to have the opportunity to win the game.